to change the oil because it's such a low car and put it on wood blocks and then you can jack under your control arm is a nice strong point get it up the jack stands there's two jacking points on either side and change your oil like I said ooh, somebody has I'm not gonna point any fingers my girlfriend but somebody has scraped at <laughs> something it could have been there when she bought this car who knows all right, so to change the oil, you're yeah, gonna need some oil. AutoZone had a sale. This is fully synthetic, is all I got? Yeah, it was like all this. I think this takes six quarts. It's a pig, big engine, three, two point, three liter, I don't know, those BMW beasts. It's a straight six. Uh, STP, probably people make fun of me for that, but I had to do two containers. That lower one holds six and it was almost full. So I went for my upper. You saw how I jacked it up earlier. Put it on the wood. And the filter is yay. And it's up top. It sits in a canister. That's where the big adjustable wrench comes in. Not the right tool. I don't like adjustable wrenches, but for plastic, it's not that tight. You can use it properly. And yeah, this thing's like a pig, like I said. Uh, recommended Castrol. Okay, next time. And what else can I tell you? That's it for now. Recycle your oil. Filter came with a new O ring for here. A little oil on that. Slide it over there, make sure it fits in that groove right there. And they give you a new washer for the drain plug. Use that as well. Because there are copper that made the crush I used once. And put this filter in, cleaned out most of that in there. Fit, fit it, it did. Not the same. Well, two hands. Need yes, to do it. It fits. It was a two hand job. Uh, I'm going to take a quart of oil that I have. And I'm going to not necessarily fill it, but add some to the filter right away as I put that filter in. 